Hello everyone, this is Hunter Collector with another action figure review, and here we have the Marvel Legends series Morland. So let's go over the packaging first. So first we get the Marvel Legends logo here on top, Spider-Man logo down here, Morlin. Here is the cider of Morlin. Here is the back with that same artwork with the description here, Marvel Legends. And then here we will be building the Armadillo Builder figure uh, for this wave. We are already went through all the figures which come with the integrated suit, black and gold suit. Doctor Strange, J. Jordan Jameson, Miles Morales, we're all growing over Marlin right now. And then we already did Shriek last time. Here's the other side. Here is the top with the spider emblem there. And then here's the bottom with the DCPI. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here is Marlin and the package here. So let's go over the accessories. So first we get Armadillo's right arm, which we'll go over once we build them, as per usual. And then the only other accessory that we got here is Marlin's extra head sculpt here, which is He's kind of like mad face kind of. He has like a big grin. His eyebrows are pretty much up. He, you get his mouth open there. You can see some teeth in there. I'm not sure if you can see his fangs or not. I don't see any fangs. <laughs> and then you get the hair slicked back, a pale skin, red eyes. Yeah. So yeah, that's head, that head sculpt. And then here's the other one. If it'll focus, there we go. <laughs> So this one, he's just kind of grinned, but his mouth is not quite open. But yeah, you get the red eyes there. They look pretty good. And then you get the slicked back hair with that V look there for the hair. <coughs> and here's the back here. The hair goes over the back pretty well. It's like very fitting. And then, like I said, pale skin. You get some teeth showing. And then here is his jacket. Uh, so this whole thing is soft plastic over his torso. So this is all one piece right here. This is not his body mold. And then here you got the arms. I am surprised that there's pe peg holes. Um, I thought this was a brand new arm joint, but maybe I'm wrong. And then here you get the buttons for his hands. I meant his arm for his sleeves. And then here is his hands. They're pretty wide open. He kind of looks like he's doing the alien hand there but as you can see there's the suckers on his hand there that if you touch you know if he touches someone you can suck the blood out of him he's got long nails and then you get this red like jewel on his chest there with this purple scarf over it and then this very silvery um, vest there with some black buttons here's the other hand here doing the same thing and then here is his pants. They're gray. You get the black belt with the buck, uh, silver buckle. Still pin joints. And then here is the shoes. And then you get this like little flat piece here. You get some buttons in there for that. But besides that, let's go over the articulation for him. So he has a uh, disc ball joint in the head. Only goes down that far. Up just that far. Left and right movement though. Pretty good. Not a whole lot of pivoting. Shoulders can move out that far. 360 rotation there, bicep swivel, double jointed elbows, wrists can hinge down that far, up that far, 360 rotation there. He has an ab crunch in there, but it doesn't really do much because of that vest piece there. Kind of, is, But since it's a soft plastic, I think they left a lot of room to kind of move it. You can kind of move it just a little bit. Backwards, a little too. You got a waist swivel, 360 rotation there. Legs can kick out that far forward that far backwards none thigh cut double jointed knees and then you also got a shin cut in there deep in the pants and then ankle scanning down that far up that far nice ankle pivot so yeah that's Marlon for you i think this is a pretty cool figure i recommend you get him because this is the only figure for Marlon, i believe um but besides that there's morbius's there's two morbius figures um but yeah this is the only Marlon one so like I said, I recommend you get him. He's a pretty good figure. Um, the head's the head can't move a whole lot, and the ab crunch is a little limited because of that thing. But I like how they gave it enough space so you can do a little bit of ab crunch. Um, but yeah, I like the details on this thing. I like the design. Um, but yeah, this is a pretty cool figure. So like I said, recommend you get him when you see him.
But yeah, that's all I got for this figure. So if you guys want to check out my link tree, it has my TikTok, Twitch, Instagram, and Twitter. So if you guys could go support me on those, that would be awesome. But besides that, thanks for watching.